Could we actually win using a random wheel generator in series 13? I'm going to be spinning for four restricted Pokemon, one mythical Pokemon, and one other random gen 8 Pokemon. If you do like the video, be sure to subscribe if you haven't already, and leave a like and comment down below what you guys want to see me do next on Sword and Shield. So yeah, let's go ahead and see what the wheel will give us for restricteds. And once we get the restricted, we'll move out the wheel so we don't get duplicates. So without further ado, Let's get to spinning. All right, what's, what is the first Pokemon going to be for the Restricteds? It is going to be a Groudon. Okay. So Groudon number one. All right, let's go to number two. What is our second one going to be here? What is it? What is it? What is it? It's going to be Lugia. Okay, we can do some things with that. We can make, we can do a weakness policy thing. All right, here we go. The final restricted, what is it going to be? Is it going to be Kyogre? That'd be quite fun. Is it going to be Zacian? Is it going to be anything else? Let's see. It's going to be Calyrex. Oh, what is that? What is this going to land on? Eternatus. Okay, we'll take it. So we got Lugia, Groudon, Sogaleo and Eternatus. Let's do one for the Mythicals. All right, guys, so we've added the Mythicals into this wheel. Um, let's spin it and see what we get. All right, well, without further ado, three, two, one, spin it, baby. What's it gonna be? I, I don't really know what I would want. I don't really care to be honest, but let's see. What is it going to be? What is it gonna be? Magirna? Okay. Okay. Magirna. I'll take it. That's incredible. Wow. All right. Well, now I'm just going to get a random Pokemon from the uh, available Sword and Shield. I'm going to put it into a random thing. And um, yeah, see you guys there. All right, guys. So we arrived here. Let's go in and just click generate one Pokemon and um, yeah, see what Pokemon I'm going to get. In three, two, one. Bam. Generate. What is it going to be? Which one? Roly Coley. <laughs> Alright, well, I guess Roly Coley, welcome to the team. Alright, so, now we have our six Pokemon. Um, I'm gonna go and build them and uh, get them ready for the ladder, so, see you guys there. Alright, well, now we're in game. So, yeah, I have built the team now. Um, I'll link the EVs and stuff in the description below, but, um, yeah. This is the team. I'm excited to do this. The Roly Coley is just gonna be such a such a meme <laughs> with explosion. I'm not really gonna do too much against um, Calyx Shadow Rider, but I'm excited to play this team. Solgaleo, Groudon, Scarf, uh, Life Orb Eternatus, Solvest Lugia, Safe Girl and Garena. So we have a Trick Room like counter, so we can reverse Trick Room. And Roly Coley, I don't know. I just put it on. It's just <laughs> just too funny. I just put Focus Sash on there and say it would survive, but. Yeah, I'm excited to play this. Um, let's jump into a battle and see if we can win in Series 13 with this. Okay, here we go. We're going to Brian JP here. Running zero. Um, let's go with Sogaleo plus Groudon here. Um, and then I guess we can have a turn on this for Rillaboom and for Zygarde. And I guess we can have Magirna on the back just so we can switch in and into Zygarde for quite effectively. So, um, yeah. Let's just try with this. Let's try some gear now. Let's see. Alright, here we go. Brian JP. Let's see. Alright, what's he gonna lead off here? Probably the Zora plus um, the other one. Yeah. That's good. This is great for us. This is 
really great. We just immediately kill Zoroam and then just um, destroy you. Because the Pokemon are in the back. Yeah, he has no flying types, so this is just a very safe play. Going for Max Quake and um, Bulldoze here. Let's see what he's going to do here. What is my opponent going to do? Mr. JP. Okay, we max. We max him. Solg. Big dog. Big dog. Uh, is he Dynamaxing? He's not. Alright, well, unfortunately, my friend, you just lost the game. You just lost the game, baby. Yep, there goes your speed drops. I might just go for a thousand arrows. That'd be quite funny. No boost for you, my friend. He probably is going to go for a thousand arrows, I would assume. Hmm, he goes for a coil. Okay. Interesting. Leftovers, yeah, makes sense. We do have a turn this in back, so if that comes to that, we can just lower the speed and then uh, switch it and turn this and go for Dynamax Cannon. Kyogre comes out. Mm, not sure why you're sending out Kyogre, but okay, I guess. Alright, that's good. And Max Lightning, the Kyogre. And pull those again. I wonder if he's Scarf. Maybe that's why he sent it in. There's a possibility. But, let's see. Zygarde is minus one in speed. Well, he does have plus one attack, plus one defense, and plus 1.3 accuracy or something like that. I think that is... that's what that does. So we'll see. What he's gonna do here. I wonder if he's going to Dynamax Zygarde. We'll see. It could be Ky if it's Kyogre, amazing. If it's Zygarde, then that's alright too. It's going to be Kyogre, actually. Wow. I was not expecting that. So, we're going to get a Bulldoze plus Max Lighting off into Kyogre. Boom. And now we got Max Lightning. That's a one hit knockout on a Kyogre. Woohoo! We love Solg. We love Solgaleo. Alright, see. Coil again. Okay. <laughs> he doesn't know we have, a, we have a turn of this in the back. Did we bring a turn of this? Yeah, I think we did. I believe we did. So, one Dynamax cannon and you just end up dying, so. It's interesting. Who's his last Pokemon going to be? Zacian? It is. Okay. Um, actually, he's gonna protect here. I don't want to activate the ability until we get, um, Thuggy off, so. Let's try and get as much damage into this option as we can. And drop the speed of the other one. The Magir, uh, the Zygarde. Mm 
do a lot of damage to you, Protect, though. Yeah, nice defensive boost. Should, like, why I don't know why he keeps coiling? It doesn't really make too much sense, to be honest. <laughs> I guess he doesn't know we have Zygarde in the back. Okay, so now we can just go for Bulldoze. Actually, do we even survive under... I don't know, actually. I'm gonna put Sax first, and then Bulldoze again. Double protects. Wow, okay. Smart. I'm dropping the speed again. Is he really going for coil again? Okay, he finally went for a thousand arrows, but we protected. How much is he going to do to go out on? Yeah, it doesn't even do anything. <laughs> Alright. If you can just drop the speed of Zation. Alright, now we go for Earthquake plus Bulldoze. Then I think we'll be okay. You can't. If he wants to go for Triple Protect, it'd be my guess, I guess, but. Okay. Nice. Sog does die, unfortunately, but no, good sacrifice. Critical hit on the side guard. Nice. Big crit. Hit blade. Big crit. Okay, he goes for a thousand arrows again. Ooh, power Star Trek does go off here. Let's go for Dynamax Cannon here. Um, and then Flash Cannon this ocean. Okay. Makes sense. I mean, as long as we kill the Zashi with this Magirna, then we should be okay. And we can just go for Dancing Gleam and one shot it. Nah, that's even KO. Great. Flash cannon. Should just die. Nice. And that's pretty much gonna be GG. Great. The random team wins again. Good stuff. Rain stopped, and um, yeah, that's pretty much GG. Time. We're both special attackers, and yeah. Should be a just this one shot up. I can even just go for e Eternus Beam. Yeah, so it's plus three attack, plus three defense. Should we just go for Eternus Beam? Yeah, I want to get the cool animation. Yeah, let's go. Give me the animation, baby. Such a cool animation. That's like the coolest animation you can have in the game. But yeah, GG's. We watched you won with the random team. Wow. But yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Um, if you guys want to see more of these random things or challenges, um, let me know down in the comments below. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a great day and stay tuned for more VGC content.